Welcome to Ninth HQ, Blade HQ's YouTube channel. Today we're taking a look at an oldie but a goodie. This is the Kershaw Spring Assisted Leak. This knife has been around so long that my mother actually gave me one of these for Christmas. Uh, before there was even a Blade HQ, I hadn't started Blade HQ yet. I got a Rainbow Leak, loved that knife. That, has, and that is how timeless this knife is. It's been around since before Blade HQ existed. So that is a, that is a testament to, the, to this design by Ken Onion. Uh, hi Ken, by the way over in Hawaii with your hot wife. Um, great job on this. Anyway, so here, here's the skinny on the Kershaw Leak. Uh, this has the 14 C2 8N stainless steel blade. The body, um, the body on this knife is 410 stainless steel. It's a frame lock, which is kind of nice. I like frame locks. And then this has Kershaw's patented speed safe technology. So you close the knife, you give the flipper a push, knife takes over, opens up, of the blade, it is spring assisted. Uh, it also has the ambidextrous thumb stud. You can open it with either hand. Pocket clip, reversible, tip up, tip down. Not front or back, but tip up, tip down. And um, this also has a safety here on the bottom. So you slide this over, and then that locks there on top of the blade, and the knife cannot be opened. Specs on the leak. Overall, it's seven inches. Blade length on this is three inches. Closed length four inches. Handle thickness, super thin by the way, 0.32 inches. And then the weight on the Kershaw Leak is three ounces. Great knife, comes in a lot of different styles uh, too. This is the 1660. Uh, so this is the plain silver, plain blade. Also have uh, black here. This is CKT, 1660 CKT. Uh, and they come in a, in a bunch of different colors, too. Uh, they did a smoke series a while back. Uh, some companies actually add inserts uh, or do, do stonework on the handles of these. A lot of different variations. Great knife, though. So check them out, bladehq.com. Uh, subscribe to our channel. Leave any questions for us below in the comments. And we'll catch you next time. Thank you for watching. The Leak. Before there was Blade HQ, there was the Kershaw Leak.